The General Secretary of the Federal Capital Territory Football Association, Usman Ilerika, has lamented the effect of the coronavirus on sports and football development within the federal capital. Ilerika says several talent hunt competitions have been put on hold, thus depriving many aspiring and young footballers an opportunity to grace the big stage and fulfill their dreams. He said the pandemic does not stop players from aging, but eventually deprives them of the opportunity to move abroad after a certain age. Ilerika also expresses worry over the economic implications of the, pand the pandemic will have on football. In the last nine weeks, we have not had any training session. We have not had any contacts. The situation has been just relating on phone. The development of these children has to do with time. We know what it means. By now, we are supposed to have played what they call the NFF Zenith Bank on the 13, on the 15. We are supposed to have played FCT on the 15 program. We are supposed to have played inter area council. We are supposed to have even played, we are supposed to even play a uh, principal's cup in the FCT. All this has had, it has had an advice effect on all this tournament that we are supposed to have played. And it is not what we can rewind. Time is of big essence to us. The age of every footballer increases every day. And it makes things worse. We don't pray for anything bad. If it goes to a year or two, for instance, you know what it means in the life of a player. We are mostly, the, where the economic uh, activities takes place, mostly in football, is majorly in Europe. There's a particular age that is always required. Some people will miss out under this kind of atmosphere. Now, the, all the arms of the leagues are on break, starting from the FCT League, the Nationwide League, the uh, National League, the Premier League. All these things serve as a means of livelihood for, let me say, a very larger population of Nigerian youths. Some through the game itself, some through the managerial aspect of it, some through betting. This bet Niger, this Niger, all these different kind of betting. These are areas where people make livelihood. All these things have come to a halt.